Thank you, Natalie. If you didn't already know, you know, sales of guns always go up during the holidays. So we thought it'd be a good time to go over the basics of firearm safety. Joining us to talk about that, Bill Roberts. He's with Big Texas Firearms Training. And you guys don't sell guns, you train people. We just do training, that's correct. Good, so you should be un unbiased and, and give us your, your honest opinion. Guns have become a big seller. Mm -hmm. Why do you think that is? Well, Mike, what we're finding in our classes and the people I poll is that protection is number one. Mm -hmm. People want to be able to protect themselves and their family and their property, and they're choosing a gun as the way to do that. More women, it seems, too. I know I've been to Academy and some of these other stores that sell guns, and there's a lot of pink guns in there now, mm -hmm. which obviously is marketing them at women. Exactly. Every class I, t I teach, I have women involved. And it's the single moms that want to protect their families. It's uh, just the soccer moms that want to protect. And it's those dads, the dads that, you know, decided this is, I'm going to take a stand and I'm going to protect my family. People seem to have very strong opinions about guns. Uh, this is Texas. And, and after all, I would say probably more than half the people are, are, are pretty pro-gun. But there's a large minority, a plurality, I guess, who says the more guns, the more crime. Mm -hmm. What's your opinion on that? Well, it's just a proven fact that since, not, since 2008, violent crime has gone down 41%. In 2008, from that point on, is when a lot of the states were having concealed carry laws and put into effect. Mm -hmm. So just this last year, crime went down 6%, you know. So it's, you know, the more guns, actually, the crime goes down. So it, it's, just, it's just proven fact out there. What about giving a gun as a gift? Uh, it kind of seems like you should give, a, give the gun maybe with a... Uh, string attached that you have to go get some kind of training in, in how to use it. Exactly. I think guns are great gifts, yeah. <laughs> you know, uh, the more the better, but that's the number one thing. Safety is always number one. It's not just, you know, we say safety, but it's safety in handling the gun, safety in shooting the gun, and safety in storage of that gun. So someone has got to go get some classes, get mm -hmm. some training. You've got... Uh, you what, what are the basics? Hey, let's, let's say storage. If you're going to keep a gun in your home, whether mm -hmm. it's a, uh, uh, a long gun or a handgun, what is the ultimate uh, thing to remember as far well, as safety? Well, what, what it, safety is not is just hiding it. Uh -huh. So it's got to be locked in some way and made inoperable, especially if we've got kids in the home. Uh -huh. So that's a gun safe, that's either a trigger lock or some kind of bore lock. What about, uh, what are the options for, you know, a lot of people want to prepare for the scenario where you're sleeping and the, the burglar, you know, comes mm -hmm. in. In that scenario, you need to keep it locked, but aren't there these things that you can just put your hand on or there's, something there's, and it pops open? There are some great gun safes now, so either biometric or, you know, two or three push buttons. You set the code and it pops open. It's very easy, very access, quick access, but it's still it keeps the uh, safe from the children. The, the last question, and we're, we're sort of running short on time, Bill, but uh, a concealed handgun license, mm -hmm. who exactly needs that? Well, anyone that wants to be able to carry a gun with them most of the time. There are some restrictions, of course, but, you know, we can, you know, you need to find a good instructor, get training, get the license class, send in your application, get a fingerprint, and you can have a license in three to four weeks. And how much does it cost? Uh, the application to the state's about 140 bucks. Okay. Excellent. Bill, thank you so much. Uh, appreciate it, and have a safe new year. Thank you. We'll be back right after this.